channel in today's video we are painting these two fenders that you see behind me the fenders are prepped cleaned and ready to go and as you saw I already got my sealer mixed up so we're ready to roll first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna seal the fenders and then let it dry about 15 20 minutes and then we're gonna do our base coat clear coat and it's not gonna be your regular old glossy clear coat but these fenders are actually factory matte color factory matte Lamborghini Let's take a look. So we're going to make sure we duplicate that factory finish and make the fenders look brand new. And it's got to be super clean. As you all know, you can't cover sun and buff a uh, matte finish. So you can't have any dirt specks or debris or anything. It just has to be a flawless finish off the gun. And we're going to achieve that, I believe. I have great confidence. Let's do it. I got my clear coat mixed up, my base coat is dry, so you know what that means? It's time to clear. Let's put two coats of this matte clear on it and hope for the best. Let's go. I did my first coat. It's already starting to dull down. Remember, first coat has to go completely dull before applying your next coat. So we're almost there. I think maybe another five minutes or so and we can shoot our second coat. Looking good so far, looking good.
fenders are completely dry and wow, oh wow, I must say they look so nice. Very happy with how it turned out. Here's our spray out card. Got a nice beautiful finish. Wow. I know you guys are waiting to see the fenders. You guys want to see them? Let's take a look. So it doesn't always happen, but these fenders turn absolutely perfect. I don't know, like just like an OEM finish, honestly, not a speck of dust, super nice, clean, uniform finish. I'll show you guys that every inch of the fender, you guys can see that it truly is perfect. And it doesn't usually happen, but once in a while, I get lucky. So check this out. The finish is just so smooth, so flawless. And as I was saying before, that this matte clear, the application and how it turns out has to be absolutely perfect because you cannot touch it up, color sand or buff it. Wow, very happy with it. All the edges are completely covered. Let's check out this one. These fenders look just like they should rolling off the showroom floor. And I think our customer is gonna be thrilled. Wow. Beautiful. So this is actually my first time painting matte black fenders. I've painted a few, quite a few matte cars and bumpers and whatnot. And if you know me, you know I like matte finishes so much that I painted my own daily driver, the Ford C-Max. Take a look. This is my daily driver. This thing is awesome, super clean, super smooth. I'm excited to see Vlad put these fenders back on the car and see what the whole car looks like. It's gonna be amazing. Very sinister looking. It just has that like dark presence. And so smooth. Let's get these fenders out of the booth, give them to Wad's corner, and have them start assembly. Let's go. Just finishing up with the Lamborghini. Vlad's just buttoning it up. Once it's all put together, we're gonna get it outside, get it washed, detailed, and ready for our customer. Also, we're gonna do a little giveaway in the next video in honor of the Lamborghini Huracan. As you guys know, the color is Nero Nemesis. And I did a spray out on this plastic car model of the exact color and clear coat used on the fenders so you guys can actually see and feel the color and how the clear coat lays out and on the back side we're gonna label it the color code the description and of course the signature by yours truly lnc painter and in the next video we're gonna reveal the lucky winner who gets to keep that little spray out so something little but Something you guys get to keep from this Lamborghini Huracan. So don't forget to comment Nero Nemesis, which is the name of the color on this Lamborghini in the comment section, and you'll be entered to win. Anyways, if you're new to the channel and you like this kind of content, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss any new videos. For now, we're gonna get back to it. We're gonna get the car assembled, get it into the wash in detail, and we'll reveal the project when it's all done.